Diamond, we could do with another round of drinks. Oh, could you now? Well, you know where the pumps are at, don't you? Hey, you should get off home. Why? Well, there's been a kind of kick-off on the street. Mm. Gail dragged your mum out the cell on. Not too pretty by all accounts. Well, is she all right? Oh, yeah. I don't think her hair's turned out quite the way she does, but she did manage to tear a new pocket in Gail's blazer. I'm starting all that. You wouldn't believe it if she told no, you. Are we playing cards or what? Listen, I'm going to have to check on my mummies. Well, you can't get up mid-hand. But I can take over if you want. Well, you don't even know what he's got. Well, we'll do in a minute. That is if uh, people don't mind me playing. I know some of you might feel uncomfortable. It's a free country. It's fine, Mrs Connor. Oh, thanks, Carla. Well, I've got a minute. What about our drinks? I'll only be an hour. <clears throat> I'll be the one doing a streak in a minute, because she'll have the shirt off my back. I would say she's on fire, but in the circumstances. Damn. So, what happened to your... Oh, no, Liz, I wouldn't mention it. It's a bit of a sore point. I'm oh. fine. You don't have to worry about me. You can worry about me if you want. Beth's going to kill us. Did you steal the cards, yeah? Nah, I'm finished. Yeah, me too. I know I'm beaten. All right, does that mean I get my living room back then? I reckon so, Liz. Oh, you cowards, I was just warming up. You know... If that top had sleeves, I'd be very suspicious right now. Hey, I'm no cheat. I learned to play poker the hard way in LA. Susie takes no prisoners. You know what? I really enjoy that game. Anytime you're up for a rematch, I am. You won't be so lucky next time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I take it it's beans on toast tomorrow night then now. Uh, no, 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 we'll still go. I never gamble more than I can afford to lose. You didn't look too happy about it about fishwives. They only wanted a box of kippers between them. I'm, well, I mean, really, I mean, nobody wants to see that sort of thing. How do you manage to see it, then? Uh, well, I'm sweeping up. Oh, what, outside the cellar? Well, well, well no, but I heard this fracas and I felt it was my duty to investigate. I mean, after all, I am the neighbourhood watch coordinator. I am the ears and eyes of this community. Mm, well, you're certainly the mouth. Why are you drinking halves? It's all I can afford. And I don't want to go home and face Beth. Yeah, well, drinking halves or not, your face gets any longer, it'll be in that glass here. No, you want it off us fair and square. Listen, I don't want to hear you and your missus go hammering tongues tomorrow at work, all right? You don't feel right. It was Dan that I wanted to give the whipping to, not you. If you don't take it now, I'll stick it in your wage packet. Cheers, Mrs. Connor. I'll make it up to you. Just stick to playing happy families in future. I haven't been to the clock in years. Not since that business with the condemned meat. <laughs> no, it's, it's back on track now. The new owners have spent a fortune. Well, if the food's that good, maybe we should think about working up an appetite. Any ideas? Well, I, I thought you didn't want to rush things. We know what they say about changing your mind. It's a woman's prerogative. Right. <laughs> Michelle. You fancy taking over? Yeah. Uh, is everything all right? Yeah. Yeah, never better. I just feel like treating myself to an early night. 